Hi, my name is Prem Asim Jain and in this Mongo tutorial session we are going to learn about how to remove or delete the data. So uh, if we we'll go to the API, there are different versions of MongoDB out there since 2.0 which supports different uh, methods to do it. But more or less they perform the same way. It's just that uh, uh, new APIs or new methods are coming up to avoid confusion. For example, uh, the remove method. So previously there was something which is called as remove and uh, which will have just one parameter to make sure that we are accidentally not recording all the record or we are trying to just remove one record at a time. So if we'll do a db.test.find so in the sample data which I have, I have two kind of records wherein the key where the key matches is Asim and where the key matches as Bragdish. So first we will try and try to do uh, the uh, query with remove. So once you do db dot uh, whatever your collection name and then you will try. So autocomplete says there is something which is called as remove and autocomplete also says that there is something which is called as delete many and delete one this is the recent uh, thing which have came up but we will just try to do okay we want to do a remove now inside the removal we have to do a match wherever the key matches a same gen we have to remove that now inside that first i will i want only one record should go away we'll just see the API documentation real quick so in the remove first part would be your query and second part would be your just one which is a camel case so we'll go and we'll try to figure out just one boolean and we'll just make it as true which means that we will first try this out and what we want is just one should be true so this guy has removed one record we'll do a quick find and then so whatever there were uh, you know keys for which uh, this guy was there it has been removed now we will try and make just and we we'll, we can make it false or by default the value is false so as soon as i do this it has removed three records now we will do a find so all the records with the name asim has been removed now we'll do find and we will uh, learn the new way of deleting uh, um, in mongo shells which is 3.2 plus or 3.4 whatever the latest they have it but older does not, does not support this so de delete db dot collection name dot delete one and this will take a matcher information wherein we can give it the key and then we will hit enter so it gives the acknowledgement that value has been removed true and deleted count is one so we will find that one record has been removed same way it also has uh, another method which is called as delete many so we will say many which means whatever records um, which matches this they all will be removed so now if we do query there is nothing with the key which is called as Bradish. so this concludes uh, this uh, uh, session that uh, uh, for removing the records we have couple of methods backward compatible so previously there was just a remove with a parameter of just once so remove if you do remove it will remove all the records whatever it matches so accidentally if you uh, do something like this i'll just give you an example i don't want to um, remove all my test data but if you do something like this by mistake 
and enter so it will wipe out all the records because everything matches and then it will record everything so the best practice is you will make uh, a, a one query work for you wherein you will have your key and some whatever value you want it to remove and you make it work and then you uh, might want to remove all the records so in this case uh, you might want to use just once true or false whatever but uh, the better ways you can instead of passing another parameter you can always do a delete one query and then you can pass it just takes one object you can pass whatever key value pair you want to be deleted and that would delete once you are confident enough after this query you can uh, do a delete all so over here since i have given it all the fields it matched all the fields but since it is one so it has only deleted first record and rest all records are there same way you can do delete many and then uh, then it would wipe out and everything 